I yeah, this is the only way you could think of setting this up. I don't know how this looks. I can't even see what that camera's doing, but something nice came. Something, hi, something very nice came, I think. I hope it's what it is. If it's something else, then that's weird. But no, it, it is. Do we have a nice, whatever this is here. Let's just open this up so we can make sure it is. There you go. God, there we go. I'm a very, um, Elegant packager of what is this? My invoice. I will probably throw that away and never look at it. But here we go. Let's have a look here. Hope I'm not damaging that. So, okay. The box is, is being opened. The box is being. Wow, this actually looks. This actually looks really nice. Let me just check this. Wow. This looks beautiful, actually. Just make sure it's in focus. Nice bubble wrap, too. Really nice build wrap. So we got limited run 366. So I'll show that there. Show that there. This is actually a really nice card, can I say? Um, so we're number 366. Lovely. That's awesome. Let me just put that somewhere safe. Let's just take this out now. And wow, this is actually. This looks really nice. And um, see that else in here? Paper. Recycling. Lovely. Good to know. So. Um, let's move this out of the way and actually get the main focal point here, which is this. So, um, yeah, oh, do I really want to open this? Look at that, look how beautiful that is. I don't know if you can see it there, so look at this. Oh, oh, this looks nice. It's, it's a bit dented, I think. No, no, it's actually the design. I oh, know it's a bit dented here, actually, if you can see that. Um, yeah, but who cares? I mean, it's transit, it's stuff's so gonna get damaged. I'm just happy. I have this. Oh, I just. Oh, I'm gonna open it. I know it, it's like I'm not that type of person who uh, just keeps on open shit under shelves. So I'm just gonna open this up and oh, even though I don't, I don't, I don't know what to say. Honestly, you can probably tell by my voice. I'm just a bit excited and exhausted. Right, he wants paper and plastic. Good for the environment, I hear. Right. Um, I don't want to get rid of this. Oh shit, it's already opening. Oh, I saw something. I, I thought it looked nice. I don't want to get rid of this. Where am I going to put this? This looks lovely. Right, look at this. This is amazing. I'll probably just stick this in my wall or something. Or I don't, No, no, I'll just keep on the back of it. Fuck it, I'll film paper on the back of it. I'll just put this somewhere safe. Now, here we go. We're just going to see. Yeah, we're in frame. Okay. This is probably the worst unboxing in the history of unboxings, so I don't care. Let's Let's open this. Oh Jesus! Holy shit! <laughs> Look at that. Mmm, yummy. Ah, <sighs> so we have the game. Uh, not the cover I would have wanted, but it's fine. I'll just reverse it. I'm gonna open it anyway, so I'm not one of those people. I'll just keep it unopened. And so yeah, uh, but yeah, that's fine. So yeah, just reverse that cover, and it's gonna be lovely. The best pour of the Jack games ever. Absolutely, yeah. Here we have. I don't know what to go to next. Here. We have, I'll just see what's under, a poster, oh wow, it's actually a much heftier poster than I expected. Open this up, my hands are shaking, holy shit. Let's open this up and, oh, that's actually pretty fucking beautiful. Holy shit. Um, this is like, I don't know, I'm putting it on my wall with some measure. It's pretty big, it's, it's, bigger, it's bigger than I thought it would be. So that's, that's cool. Um, now I'm never going to be able to fold this up again because that's how posters go. Oh, it's never going to go back in the same way. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, here we go. Ah. Alright. There, that's as good as I'll get it. I'll be putting this in my wall anyway, so it's no big deal. Um, oh, the, the, the main event for me, honestly, the soundtrack. The, the fuck, oh, I'm just going to... Oh, two disc soundtrack. Look at all these fucking tracks. It has the demos and the unused versions of each one that were originally on Josh Mansell's SoundCloud and that's just... Wow. Right. Here we have our trading card set, which I'm probably gonna open and show you better in a few minutes. And uh, the little precursor orb, which is... Oh my god, actually. This is much better than I was expecting it to be. 
Um, I was expecting this. Ugh, fucking sneaking under the table. I was expecting this to just be like a 3D printed piece of shit, but it actually has some heft to it. And um, it has like, it's kind of at the bottom, so, so you can like just stand it up. So nice, nice. And uh, of course, the little, uh, how does this thing work? Uh, the little memory card, um, 16 gigabyte memory suit, which should come in handy for something, I guess. Now this feels exactly as I thought it would feel cheap and shitty and probably very slow, but I'll, I'll test that out later on. But uh, no, that's, uh, that's that. How do I, I find it difficult to actually get the contacts out of it? Oh, I'll do that later, it's fine. But yeah, and then here we just have this and not an under, so yeah, that's that, that's that. I will put everything back in now. Right then, so we're gonna look at the trading cards. Um, here they are. Mm, you and me. Um, so yeah, let's uh, open these up without destroying the packet if we can. Right, oh wow, these are actually really nice. So on the back of them, we have all just the Jack and Daxter logo. It's a really nice Jack and Daxter logo, actually. It's, uh, it's the Jack and Daxter logo, of course, it's nice. But first up, we have Gollan Maya. Mm, yummy. Um, second, we have, and these are all really glossy, really high quality, actually, really high quality cards. And then we have uh, Daxter. We all know that render, it's a lovely render, but again, like, it, it shines and shit, it's really high quality. Kira, the map background, again, beautiful. Um, the, the card. Uh, Samos, now, that, now that it's not only the card that's beautiful here. Fucking, no, these are such, like, these are really nice, like, really high quality. Holy shit, that's a fucking render I've never seen before. Look at this. Jesus, oh god, look at that jack with like a precursor surfboard. What the fuck? That's really... I've never seen that in my life. If it'll focus. I didn't use DSLR for this because it wouldn't focus either. And it's shitty DSLR anyway, but yeah, look at that. Mm. Uh, lovely precursor orb. Again, these are really nice. And uh, OCD, let's do these properly. Then we have a something, uh, Jack, uh, we know this render, it's really nice though, nice night, um, Sandover Village with all the main characters. And then we have the two themselves, Jack and Daxter, really nice cards, I'm actually really impressed with them. I wasn't, um, uh, one, like, it wasn't one of the things that I was particularly looking forward to, the main thing I was looking forward to, honestly, was the, the the soundtrack and it, I still haven't opened it yet, I will in a minute. Um, but yeah, that's, they're really nice. Let me just put these back in their packet and uh, lock them in the box. But yeah, this is one thing about this um, collector's edition, which I have, um, Jesus Christ, get in. One thing about this collector's edition that I've realized is that it's really like top notch quality. Like it's not just 3D printed bullshit with like, oh, let's just give them all this bollocks. Cause that was one thing I was worried about where it just wouldn't feel premium, where it just wouldn't, it would just like be a half-assed job. Um, but no, this feels like, it feels high quality, which is awesome. Let me just put these back in and show you the rest of the stuff. Aha, back in, like they are never opened. I can resell this on eBay for millions. Let me just put this back in. Yeah. Pop, nice little place there we go. Now just say, this smells glorious. Oh. Um, what should I open next? I'll let you choose. Game or soundtrack? Fuck you, I'm opening the soundtrack. Actually, no, the soundtrack's the main event. I'm opening the game. Um, so yeah, I, I probably shouldn't be doing this, but again, I'm not a guy to keep on opening games on the shelves. So I, I get games to play them. And I'm really interested to see how differently these versions play than the digital versions, which most likely will be not, um, not different at all. I'm just reading the um, ratings and stuff on the back here. Just back to the case, by the way. But a uh, new Night Dog logo's on it. But yeah, I'm gonna turn around this case. Uh, let me just... Uh, oh god, the keys won't penetrate. Right. So... We're gonna... 
open this up, see. Jesus, open please. Right, mmm. Always one of my favourite things about new games, just opening them. Like, opening the, uh, the wrapping. Oh, it smells that new game smell. Jack and Daxter new game smell, what? But I have so much plastic around my room right now, it's not even fucking funny. But, right. So here's the case, without the cling film, glaring everything up. And then let's open it up, and oh, we get the map as well, of course! No manual. But uh, we get the map, and um... I don't know if the Americans got a different version, or not. But I guess... I don't know if the Americans got a different version of this or not, but this um, is much smaller than the one we got. Let me just compare it here. Well, in width-wise, it's much smaller, should I say. Um, yeah, it, it's... Uh, we have a nice poster there. I don't know why anyone would want to use this side, except they want the concept under one well, no, but it's kind of ruined by the controls and stuff. Map itself, again, ruined by the fucking controls and stuff. Like, move that to the back or something, like, Jesus. But, no, I, I'm nitpicking now. Um, yeah, that's the side that's going on my wall, but I'm not putting this on my wall because I already have a better one on my wall. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. I mean, I guess you could just put it up like that on your wall. You know what? I might do that. That's a pretty good idea. So, um, yeah. Eh. Wow, that, that's as good as I'm going to get it back in. And here's the disc. Um, there's the disc. Really nice disc, actually. I like it. I like it a lot. And uh, the reversible cover is here. I'm just going to reverse that now because... Not a big fan of the cover of Zana, honestly. Just a silhouette of the re render, like that. But, but um, let's just turn this around. Oh, it's kind of stuck. Oh, wow. That... Jeez. Okay. There we go. That's better. That's much better. Okay. Right then. There we go. And there we go, right. Nice. Now that's, I just think that looks so much better in every way. Um, colors are right. And I was worried to get the colors wrong on it and make it look, it doesn't look that good on the webcam, but um, it's in real life, it, the colors are perfect. They're fine. And uh, back again, a bit too dark, but whatever. Um, no, nice, really nice. Good, good that. Uh, now, I hit my mic now. Um, uh, the the main event for me anyway the soundtrack um fucking hell how do i cds are always really hard to open uh. open please aha right 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 here we go i think i've gotten somewhere Oh no, don't damage the CD of all things. <laughs> ah, don't drop. Okay, here we go. Oh, this just... <laughs> I'm really excited for this. Just to have the soundtrack in my hands in high quality. Fuck. I hope it's like, I'm sure it's like, I'm sure it's the originals. Just the fucking raw files put on to it but um ah uh, let's have a look here um two discs let's see if we get an oh we do we get a track list <laughs> holy shit this is yeah this isn't disappointing so far we don't get a track list but we do get a nice um inlay on it so that's really nice um yeah a track list would have been nice but oh well there we go oh well we get the track list in the fucking back like who cares but a bit more information about the music in a little booklet maybe, but I'm nitpicking. Um, we have the disc, disc one here, let's just take it out. Ah, it's broke! And disc one here. Um, lovely. Lovely. And then, uh, put that back in before I destroy it. And then disc two. Oh, we might have... Oh, we have a nice little, um... I thought it was a It is the track list, technically, it's just the back of it. But then we have a, a little power cell there. 
And uh, oh, a really, really nice art for uh, the second part of the disc. Lovely. Uh, Golemite are really dark. I love that. Awesome. Uh, I think that's pretty much everything. Um, yeah, I'm just really happy to have this in my hands. It was such a fucking pain in the arse to get. Such a big catastrophe to get. But um, yeah, we, we have it now. Um, I haven't shown these two things in this one. So we have the little memory card here. You have to really on jam. Little nice not not dog logo there, but really have to odd jam the um the USB part of it. Um I don't know what speed or and this is I'm too lazy to check on the scene, probably never gonna use this. Just gonna keep it in the box. But it's glorious box by the way, it's really nice. Um so yeah, and then we have the precursor orb which is actually surprised me with how nice it is. Lovely. And this will probably actually go on my shelf. I think it's really nice. So uh, yeah, that's everything. We have um, the silly memory card. Just don't like the memory card idea. Um, we have the dragon cards. We have the soundtrack. Best part of it, which will be coming out in a minute. And being put straight on my PC. Um, the game itself. Well, actually, this goes in first. Uh, the poster. Uh, the, the game, of course. Probably just install that. <clears throat> uh, the trading card. Or not the trading card, the uh, card with your number on it. So I'm 366. And, of course, the cursor orb. And you get a nice, neat little package for about, well, 100 euro, about. Eighty dollars because you don't get raped on shipping. Fun thing actually, I didn't get raped on shipping. Well, I did when I first paid, but um, no customs charge, which is really weird from America, but awesome. So here we go. Just this is it here. And uh, that's a thumbnail image, by the way. And uh, yeah, lovely. This is going straight on that shelf up there. I'm really happy to have it. Like just looking at it in my hands, man, it's nice. Here's the back of it. Probably want to stick this onto the back of it. I don't know. But yeah, this is it. Lovely. Lovely. Really happy with it. Really glad I got it. And Jack 2 should be soon because Jack 2 was shipped shortly after this. So I'll see you for that one. And I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I know it wasn't the best unboxing, highest quality. This is a really rushed job. But um, yeah, I hope you found some enjoyment out of it. Good luck.